great. She's so pretty, though. <laughs> She's stoic. She's like. All I see is the loading screen. I don't see Emily oh, you don't see being Emily. pretty. Oh. Oh, I She's wish I saw Emily. Slightly moving. Sli oh, I see you now. I see the I sad, heard her voice. Sad. Okay. Okay, I hear you. I hear you, I hear you, I hear you. Okay. Um, oh, fuck me. <laughs> Take <Technology laughs> my room eating. Hey, Todd, I'm sending you something really quickly. Okay. On, uh, roll 20. See if my stream thing pops up here. Maverick. I think the whole reason why there's connectivity issues on your guys' side is because Maverick. It's it's definitely Maverick. It's definitely one hundred percent Maverick. I I think it's Garrett. Because Todd put in a fancy thing, and I think it steals all the internet access. So rude. Okay, so you're inadvertently blaming Todd. Yeah, because I saw him do it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to respond to you. I, I, is your name the, the number one Boblin fan right now? Or, yes, I'm number one Boblin. But, but uh, do I have to put in? You can like, type in as Morlias. You can do slash oh. W M and Chapo as Morlias. Oh, see, I thought I had to type in the name of your character. Mm -mm. No, you good dog. Okay. Oh my god, guys, I'm so okay. fucking lit. I'm so lit. Okay. I can't deal with this right now. Uh, live and where did it? Oh go? no. Where did it I can't see Emily on my screen. I know. And it makes me very really sad. Oh, there's an Emily. I can't see her still you on Discord. You can't see her on yours? Oh. See nothing. Oh, I guess I don't necessarily she's... have to see her face, but like... She's ejecting a cat right now. Okay, can you at least hear an Emily? Yeah, I, I can hear her. Ignore the... Those things. What uh, things? Jessica, the, I don't know what they're called, hanging racks. Oh. Jessica hangs her clothes in my room and doesn't take them out. Why does she hang her clothes in your room? That's weird. I don't know. She has the master bedroom, so I don't know why she's putting it in my small ass hobby room, but whatever. Weird. Anyway. Um, Okay. So, uh, we are just getting back from a couple of split sessions where the party has been apart for some time. We've not been a party. We've been apart. Yes. A party part apart. Part C. Part C. Part C. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> um, and uh, you have both arrived uh, at this point in time. Uh, in Nellwood, you're, all of you have uh, reconformed together uh, in Nellwood. Mm -hmm. uh, right now, uh, Boblin and uh, Morlias are kind of having a heart-to-heart -heart in Gila's home, as uh, Miss Sasuke and Kisame are having a heart-to-heart -heart in one of the Uchiha homes. One of? They only have one. <laughs> What? What'd you say, babe? What? What? Oh, I didn't say anything. I didn't say anything. I thought you said stuff. I thought you said things. Oh, I, I was going to say, you. I don't remember this heart to heart with Kisame, but actually I wouldn't mind talking to Kisame though, so that works. <laughs> okay. Did you see my, did you see my whisper? Um, ah, I see. Uh, it's the name of the other goats. Let me fix that up real quick. They're beautiful names. Oh, 
<laughs> gotta make sure everybody can see these nameplates. Okay. Um, and then I don't even think I'm on the same screen as you guys. I'm not. Uh, so we just ended with Boblin and Morlias. Um, so what what was your immediate plans? Like were dungeon. you what? Dungeon. 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 You were the fungeon. The fungeon. Uh, Fun dungeon. 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 <laughs> We are going to say Dungeon. that you Dungeon. guys are probably just now exiting your home in Nellwood. Dungeon. Just kind of Dungeon. popping out from there as yeah. you see doo -doo 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 -doo, what Dungeon. looks to be Miss Kisame or uh, Miss, Mr. Kisame and Miss Sasuke Uchiha. <laughs> Not for fucking long. It's all blended together. Uh, <laughs> so go ahead, Miss Sasuke. Oh, there's two of me. Place Look, there's yourself two of me. here. Oh, I have twins. Double vision. Twins. Uh, and yeah, you guys are both kind of exiting your homes at the same time, and you lock eyes with each other, seeing each other for the uh, first time in six and a half days. <laughs> I draw my bow. Uh, oh. <laughs> Morlias looks with a bl just a just a blank expression, um, and then starts behind... walking the other direction. <laughs> starts walking. I hide behind Kisame because I'm like Boblin's here somewhere trying to one shot me. I just know it. I'm over the bar. Kisame. No, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go visit Isaac. He's like, you don't think we should go talk to him? Um, no, we should. We should. I need to talk to you really fast though. But, yeah. um, yeah, I should go talk to them as well. What do you need to talk to me about? Um, something in private. They ain't finding me. <laughs> yeah. You don't see a Boblin. He's hiding behind Gilza. Oh, oh, oh. You, know you, you just see me, you look at each other, go, oh, shit, you look back and I'm gone. <laughs> <laughs> and even then, I'm sorry to say it, but your nat 20 would still be less than my stealth. <laughs> But, but it's a natty, it's though, a natty. So natty. It doesn't matter. You can't nat on a stealth chair. Or... <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Anyways. Um, okay, yeah. Um, I'll be like, yeah, kiss me. Let's just go to the bar. I'll talk to you after the bar. It's important, though. Oh, all right. And, yeah, he's following you to the bar. Uh, Boblin, are you in pursuit? Yeah. Okay. So we are headed to the bar. Uh, Jaeger is there. Tonks is there. Um, Morlias, you uh, go ahead and place. No, yourself. I no, I went to the medical center. Oh, you went to the medical center. Oh, yeah. okay. Oh, okay. You definitely said the bar. You I did liar. say the bar first. I did say the bar first, but I meant to say medical center. They're ah, interchangeable. Ah. Okay. Well, we're just just pop pop us there because that's. <laughs> okay, so you are headed to the medical center then. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, well, though, there's a Boblin. He gone. Woo! Uh, uh, what chaos? What chaos do I walk into here? How's it going in here? How um, old are the as, adult? Yeah. Things? As you are uh, walking in, you notice there's actually a few less people in here, um, and a lot of the ones that are up and around are there. There's no more. Um, ambient sounds of like children just like or like baby people they all seem rather calm ish like there's you can definitely still see dagger and stagger like running around the room right now just kind of like racing each other almost are they teens right now are they like moody teens basically basically oh yeah. my god yeah Great. so you're you're walking into uh, a relatively peaceful scene compared to what you've seen uh last few times you've been in the medical center excellent i want to go straight to isaac oh, okay uh yeah he sees you he's like oh malias uh just for um just for what so the dungeon that you're talking about gilla in our messages was to uh go to the dungeon that I was talking about or a different dungeon? 
The one in the north. Okay, so the one to talk to... Um, what's his name? To the Argonaut. God. Argonaut. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot God's name. Whoops. Um, <laughs> Yahweh? I don't know. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I, I thought we had something else we were supposed to do before then. Uh, oh, uh, we were going to talk to uh, Lucinda and the, the, the misers. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we're you... going to have that... That disguised a meeting. Yeah, yeah, because uh, Lucinda expressed that the misers desperately want to meet with you, Morlaya, so that you know that they are. Maybe that. Okay, not can happy. we do another? Can we do another like solo campaign with me and Todd at a different point in time to do that? Because that's like. Sure. Yeah. Okay, we'll just do different. We'll do this instead. <laughs> Emily, you can watch it. <laughs> <But> <laughs> yeah. Stand outside the door and listen. <laughs> yeah, Kisame is walking on in. Oh, okay. Sorry, I'm like flipping between screens. It's weird. No, you're okay. Okay, okay I go up and I'm 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 with Isaac and I say, Isaac, um, I would like to go talk to Argonon today. He's like, you want to do that today? Yes, come with me, please. Oh, all right. Um. And I take both of his hands, I'm going to take both of his hands and kind of like in a desperate kind of plea, and I'm still a little bit fucked up from last night, but uh, <laughs> I'm like, I'm like desperately hung over from last night, <laughs> and I'm like shaking a little bit, because I'm so hung over, and I say, <laughs> Isaac, I need you to come with me, I can't do this alone. He's like, I will come with you. Um, Thank you. Just, uh, and yeah, Miss, uh, Miss Sasuke, uh, you're, you're definitely hearing all of this. Um, okay, um, also, do I see Boblin? <laughs> Um, no, no, he's still hiding. <laughs> you got a, you got a 29 on stealth. You got a 25 on perception. That was, that was, that was in a different place, though. That was this in a different a place, but he is, yeah, but. <laughs> I'm uh, going to find him one of these days. <laughs> uh, Someday. Is, we'll see. Uh, he's just like, well, I have the clerics coming in today, but they should be arriving here fairly early this morning. If you give me just, say, until later afternoon. Um, That's fine. I can wait. Then I will have them all oriented, and then I can go with you. Yeah, I can wait. That's fine. Okay. And then Morlias turns around, and he sees Mrs. Sasuke and Kisame, and then he... Is there a back... Is there a back exit to no, the... No, uh... no. This okay. is not fire safety town. Okay. You have one this exit. <laughs> this is one exit. <laughs> that was really funny, oh. Garrett. Perfect. Uh, and then Morlias uh, looks at them, kind of like, does a little haughty, like, like a sniff, and then he walks past them out the door. Um, <laughs> she follows Morlias. <laughs> oh, okay. Goodbye. Uh... Oh. Yeah, and Boblin, you're seeing all of this. Morlias is exiting with a Kisame and uh, uh, Miss Sasuke in hot pursuit. I'm just going to shout Morlias. I'm just watching. He's going to the, uh, he's going to go see Vincent. His boyfriend. They've made it official! I don't know if you watched the last episode, Emily, but they no, made it official. They did make it official. Nice. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna follow them. And I'm just gonna be like, like Merlias. Merlias. I'm gonna say their name uh, over and over again until you <laughs> respond. Yes, asked for asks desperately for coffee from Vincent because he's terribly hungover and he does not have the strength <laughs> to deal with Mrs. Sasuke without caffeine. <laughs> yeah, Vincent is like, uh, of, of course. And then he kind of waves to you, Miss Sasuke. He's like, good morning, Miss Sasuke, Mr. Kisame. Hi, Vincent. Hi. Hi. And he goes. And he I say, I, w I lean in and I whisper. I'm like Vincent. You have to talk to them. You don't have to. <laughs> He's like, no. They were very kind to me this last couple of days. Because mm, they're manipulating you. <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, he goes. He's cr he's making that cup of coffee right now. Uh, Miss Sasuke, Morlias, or or uh, are you guys interacting at all, or are you just having like? I'm. I sit next to Morlias. I'm like Morlias. Can we talk? Morlias is not sitting, but that's fine. Okay, well, I stand next to Morlias. <laughs> Morlias crosses his arms and turns away. Okay, well, I will talk to you. Um, I'm sorry for my behavior of the last um, couple weeks, and I'm trying to make amends, and I don't know if you've heard or seen some of the community service that 
me and Kisa may have been doing in the kingdom. Uh, Morlaius um, turns on uh, on Emily. <laughs> on Mrs. Sasuke, looks at her and says, yeah, I noticed the community service. I noticed the goat you brought in. Lovely name. I'm sorry about that. Um, Kisame named named the goat, not me. I don't think that's okay. I told him it was very immature. Oh. I roll an insight check. Oh, absolutely. I would like to do this as well. Miss <laughs> uh, Sasuke, go ahead and roll me a deception check here, real quick. Whiff, whiff, yeah. <laughs> Boblin. She seems to be telling the truth. More lies. Wow, I've... she's full of shit. <laughs> <laughs> I still think my character wouldn't be convinced. He'd be like, he'd be like, you're naturally <laughs> sus, I'd say, but yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah. So, if there's anything that I can, me and Kisame can help with, um, we would love to help. I know it's going to take time for you to trust me again. Um. Yeah. Does Morlaius have his coffee I'm... yet? Dungeon Master? Uh, yes. Yes, he does. Okay, he takes a really long, really, really long sip, and he looks at Mrs. Sasuke, and he says, We actually could use some bodies for a uh, dungeon crawl later today. Yeah. Um, I mean, I'm free. Kisame, are you free for uh, to go into a dungeon? And Kisame's like, uh, sure. He's like, um, and he kind of whispers in, he's like, we are still technically on house arrest, though. But Madara, we'd have, oh, to, we'd have to sneak out. I, I do have, well, I I do have to ask um, my probation officer if I'm allowed to leave. The <laughs> but I, I think it'll it be doesn't okay. Madara, your probation officer. <laughs> yeah. Can, can, can Bob, Bob was just like, like leaning up against one of like the, like the crates behind all of this. And he's going to yell from behind. This sounds like an abusive ex relationship. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, please take me back. I got to get, you know, a permission for my probation officer to go somewhere with you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh. But can I find Bobla now, though? He's he doesn't what am really I hiding? Spoke, so. I got a 13. 13. I'm not hiding. He, yeah, <laughs> he's not hiding. <laughs> Uh, hi, Boblin. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> um, I'm going to start referring um, to you guys as the help. Like... <laughs> <laughs> that's fair. That's, that's fair. Um, we would like to help, so that's an important thing. Um, but I do Ooh, ask that if... <laughs> <He's> dead. <laughs> Killed Katie. Okay. Um, okay. I do ask Pablo okay. though that if we oh. if we are allowed to come and help, if you could not um try to one shot me and Kisame again, that'd be great. No, oh, if you don't key. try to steal things from people that you shouldn't be stealing things from, then you will receive no arrows in the back. <laughs> More or less point. That's fair. That's fair. Um, if I do recall, I'm pretty sure you've also stolen things that weren't yours, but we don't have to get stealing things that that that's not yours is fine. As long as it's not affecting anyone in this immediate vicinity. <laughs> like, oh, okay. Okay. That's fair. We have a code. Uh, we have a code here. <laughs> and to be fair, I also have not been caught stealing things. So. That's another. Finders uh, keeper. Point. Yeah, like, but also. Point for okay. Okay. <laughs> You're right. I need to stop blaming others for my. Actions. Yeah, just, just stop. Um, stop getting caught. <laughs> okay, <yeah>. Vincent is <laughs> literally watching all of this. this <laughs> is that some uh, good coffee, Vincent? He's like, yes. It's delicious. It's perfect. <clears throat> Everything he makes is perfect. Don't talk to him. <laughs> and I'm gonna grab. I'm gonna grab Vincent's hand and drag him off to the other side. Of the, like, of the, ah. like, of the, okay, like well, whatever this me, is. Um, are gonna go call my probation officer and see if we're allowed to come. <laughs> Um, and then I'll come find you guys, and then hopefully we can all set out. What I call my probation officer? <laughs> That's so fucking funny. Oh my god. I just want to make out with Vincent behind the stand over here. Oh, okay. You do so. <laughs> like a, it's a gentle morning makeout. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, he is reciprocate, reciprocator, reciprocatory, reci... He reciprocates. Reciprocating? Yes. Is it reciprocative? Yeah, I think 
He reciprocity, does it too. Yes. It has been received. It has been received. <laughs> uh, so uh, you're going to call Madara, Miss Sasuke, uh, Boblin. Are you? Yeah. Who are you tailing? Anybody? Or are you just kind of chilling yourself? I'm, I'm tailing them to call Madara, of course. <laughs> like... Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Get the fucking dick! Get the fucking dirt! It's Hell hard yeah. to say no with another 25 stealth check. So, uh, well, Miss Sasuke, go ahead and roll let... me one uh, compulsory perception check. Ooh, close, but no cigar. Oh my God. Yeah. No sign of Boblin as you head on over here. Uh, you give Madara a call on the ring. No okay. answer. Then oh my God. you get a call on your ring. The light indicating it's Sasuke. Oh, wait. Hang on. I think I need to write that down in my journal. Um, I answer it, though. Oh, okay. Wait, what's the light color? Ah. Silver. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I answer it. Uh, and Sasuke is like, "Hey, what what's up?" Um, why didn't he pick up his phone? He's in the middle of something. What, what, what did you need? Um, well, I was just, <laughs> I was just calling, <laughs> um, calling him to see if me and Kisame are allowed to go to this dungeon with, a uh, Boblin and, a uh, Morlias. He's like, as um, far as, as I'm of... aware, you need to stay put. Where are you going? What? That's why I'm. That's why I'm calling to ask my probation officer if I'm allowed to go for my community service. <laughs> He's like. Where also, I was you... gonna ask if, if you could come too. I miss you. Sasuke's like. I'm a little busy, at the moment. Where are you going and why? Mm. They're both busy together. Man. Honest. Man. <laughs> Honestly, um, I, they didn't give me the details. I probably should have asked. Kisame didn't ask either, though, right, Kisame? Kisame's like, yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm just along for the ride. <laughs> um, but uh, they did. They but you know, Mater did tell me to work on my uh my relationship with uh Merlias, um, and I think Boblin. I don't know if he cares too much about Boblin, <laughs> but probably him too. So that's yeah, but I still wanted to call and check because I don't I don't want anyone more mad at me. Sasuke so. kind of looks around and then he looks back at you and he's like, "Is this gonna be taking you outside of the the Western Kingdom?" I don't know. I didn't ask any details. He's like, "Get more details and then call me back." <sighs> Fine. Fine. <laughs> I hang up on him. Oh, okay. Can I do another perception check? Uh, sure. Yes. Nope. <laughs> uh, you feel a time. sense, a tingle almost, as if something small with a strange Brooklyn accent is following you. But really you small don't. and sneaky. You can't place it. Kisame. Kisame, I know he's here. Just like that I accent, you I can't quite it place it. <laughs> okay, um, I, I'm gonna, uh, Kisame, can you call Merlias on the ring? Because I think they're more likely to answer you and get the details. Or actually, actually, let me try this first. And I just yell into the abyss, like, hey, Boblin, where are we going? <laughs> no answer. Okay, call, call Merlias, Kisame. <laughs> okay. Uh, Merlias, your little Akatsuki ring is blinking. I don't have it on. Oh, that's right. Yeah, that's right. You ditched your stuff. So yeah, uh, Kisame uh, calls and he's like, no answer. He's like, hey, we know where um, they're at. Oh, this is just so annoying. Okay, let's go. <laughs> let's go find them. Okay. Unless Boblin just wants to tell me to save me the trip. I yell into the abyss. Nope. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to walk then. 
you see uh, Kisame walk that way. He does this thing where he's like walking down. He's like, I'm pretty sure they're over this way. And then he's just like immediately turns. He's like, well, I found them. I'm going to let you go talk to them. I don't know what the fuck they're doing. Because uh, Kisame just kind of walked in, saw you guys making out behind the marketplace. It's just like, whoop. And just walked <laughs> right away. <laughs> it's like that um, gift of Homer Simpson's dad. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna go and be like, Marlias. <laughs> hey. I'm sucking on Vincent's tongue, baby. Yeah. Vincent, Vincent kind of stops. He's like, oh, oh, he hello. And he's just kind of like, you know, tidies up a little. Um, thank you for responding, Vincent. Um, Marlias, uh, my probation officer's assistant slash my husband wants to know where specifically we're going. <laughs> what? For the dungeon. Lame. <sighs> Lame. Um, we're going in the North Kingdom, right? Yes. Mister, can, can I can I yell from the bush that I'm in? Uh, sure. Actually, I'm 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 just, I'm just gonna walk out. Oh, okay. That sounds awfully sus. Like you know, like they can use that information against us for some odd reason. <laughs> yeah, some strange reason, like an ambush or a um, murder. I I don't know any. I don't have any knowledge. <laughs> And if Boblin's been following me, he doesn't have any knowledge of that either. Weird. Prove it. <laughs> I just get the vibe. Just by your nature. Yeah, I mean, that's fair. That is fair, though. Um. So, yeah, can, can I know sneaky. where we're going so I can get the proper... Um, uh, you need your probation officer to, sign off, officer to sign off on where you're going? Yeah. It's really weird that you have to get permission to, like, leave. That's super weird. Because I'm on house arrest, remember? Yeah, no, I, no, I know that. I'm just saying it's really weird that you have to, like, get permission to, like, leave. It's like, you um, know. It's almost like you did something wrong. It's weird. Yeah, I did do something wrong, and I'm trying to atone for my sins. That's Me too, but it's really difficult. Really it difficult. It is. It really is. It's Anyways, can I find out where we're going, please? <laughs> So wait, wait, hold on, hold on, Meta. It's in the North Kingdom, right? Yes, a, it is uh, okay. right next to the Northern Kingdom, a ruins known as Argonon's Parish. Um, I don't say oh. Argonon's Parish, but I say the Northern Kingdom. Oh, okay. no, not this dungeon. I'm gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, sorry, that was Meta. Okay, um, so <laughs> the Northern Kingdom, you said. Word. Okay. Okay. Um, is there any other details just so I don't have to go all the way back to call just to come all the way back and ask you? Or uh, do you no. just want to come with or Merlias, do you just want to come with me while I call um my probation officer's assistant? Uh so... Merlias looks at looks at Vincent and then like says, No, I'm good and then starts making out with him again. No, okay. Okay. All right. Don't worry, I'll okay, I'll well... I'll tag along with you. Okay. <laughs> um, He'll be in the shadows so. this time. That way, um, if, if I have questions, you can answer them. I can't help um, being dark skinned. <laughs> <gasps> Don't pull the race card on me. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, I'm going to go back to my house then with Kisame and Boblin and Toe to call Sasuke again. Oh, okay. So you got Kisme and Boblin in tow. We are headed to your house. Burp, burp, burp. Um, and yeah, you call him. Um, and Sasuke again uh, responds. And he's like, did you get um, the location? Yes. Yes. Um, the Northern Kingdom. It's like, how long do you think you'll be gone? Uh, Boblin? Between a day and forever, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He's like, you, and you're going with Morlias and Boblin? And Kisame. And Kisame. Kisame. Kisame will protect me, right, Kisame? He's like... <laughs> 
Yeah. Uh, Sasuke is like... <clears throat> you want to come too, Sasuke? I can't right now. I've got a lot going on. Um, listen, you guys need to mm. be careful. Uh, Why? You realize you have marshals looking for you right now, right? No. Um, he's That's like, news to me. He's like, there was an explosion in the Eastern Kingdom. What? Yeah. Uh... They are linking it to your previous antics in the Eastern Kingdom. And now you and Morlias are both wanted by Eastern Marshals who are who have been dispatched to go find you. Um, on top of oh. that, the Misers want to talk to Morlias. The underground is a little bit unstable at this point. You need to tread extremely carefully. If you're going to this dungeon, well, why, why are you going to this dungeon? Boblin, why are we going to this dungeon? <laughs> Um, because Morlias wants to. He's because like, Morlias wants to. I understand Morlias has his own agenda. If you guys are going, go and go now. But you need to be careful on the travel there. You need to be careful if you're going anywhere in or around any of the kingdoms. And you need Sorry, to contact... Yeah, uh, you just need to be careful when you're going in or around any of the four kingdoms. And then contact me as soon as you guys are done and returning to the west. Question, are the marshals also looking for Kisame? Uh, he's like, right now, the, the people that from what I understand, the marshals have descriptions of, other than you and Morlias, is just a small goblin, a knoll, a frog, and an elven man. Well, well that's dumb. Kisame was there too. He was. Okay. Um, All right. Um... Thank you for the help. I appreciate it. Um, okay, I should probably go and tell Merlias this. Um, I need to talk to you later, though, so. He's like, listen, if you, if you need to talk to me, you, you should talk to me now. I'm not going to be terribly available for the next couple of days. I'm your wife. I want to talk mm. to my husband about married couple things. About your shark babies? Uh, Sasuke is just like, I, I understand, but if we need to talk, we need to do it now. Never mind, and I hang up on him. Oh my gosh. Okay. That's rude. Um, okay, then I'm gonna go find Merlise, but I need to take a bathroom break. Okay. Alright, I'll be back. Okie dokie. Uh, so you are headed that way. Uh, Boblin, I'm assuming you're gonna be following Miss Sasuke back? Yeah, yeah, at this point I'm staying with them. Oh, okay. Do, 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 do. You're keeping an eyeball out for me, and I appreciate mm -hmm. that. <laughs> Goblin is a true G. Uh, I'm actually going to take this opportunity to use the restroom again uh, myself. BRG. Weird. Bye. They're going to meet in the hallway. <laughs> They're plotting and against us. <laughs> <laughs> mm. I just... I, I don't trust them. Yeah. I also don't trust them. I just, it's, it's like impossible to, <laughs> like, I 
It's very sus. Mm. I'm messaging you in regard to this. Oh. Oh, come on. I typed uh, a big old long message and was like, oh, I'm able to find character. Oh, <laughs> lame. <laughs> I'm able to find character, but I'm right here. Weird. Weird. I have to, I have to say that I agree. I have to say I agree, because we don't really know, like, on our side, specifically the situation, so. No, we don't. All we know is whole... what we have on paper. At this point, so. it's just everything on that side of the border is sus. <laughs> it's just... Agreed. Oh, no, Garrett's gone. Oh, no. Like you guys were the pee pee box. Either that or he's shitting in a wind tunnel again. <laughs> I'm still a fan of uh, the conspiracy theory that you guys met in the hallway and are plotting against us. <laughs> <laughs> met in the hallway and started fucking. Started Gross. fucking. Gross. So Garrett can spread his seed. <laughs> 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 I just like the face that you made, Todd. <laughs> <laughs> you guys uh, see the new names for the goats? Yeah, I saw. Them. I, uh, I I do. Yeah. <laughs> if Gilla ever finds out, he's gonna literally eat that one. <laughs> <laughs> he's gonna pick it up and bite it in half. Like <laughs> <laughs> also, You're it. yes. Yes. Were you gonna say something, Gilla? I mean. Oh no 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 reason at all. There's just something that that Boblin knows about the goats that Miss Hoskia doesn't. So. Wait, hold on. Tell tell Morlias. You you know is... you were there. Okay, was, remind was, me. I'm. It drunk. was the thing you told me not to do. Whisper to me. Oh. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you did it anyway. No, what? No. You have to find out. You'll just have to find out. Garrett, have to find out. you it's did fine. not let them poison the goat. I did Actually, not. Why would we poison? Why is that? We didn't yeah. poison the goats. The goats are not That's poisoned. Poison. I promise. Uh, yet. We just rigged a. <laughs> Wait, why is my name changed? Fucking... Well, hey, oh, it's name? it's oh my my name in in Discord is Gilla. Okay. That's why I was like, wait, why is my name Gilla on here again? <laughs> I need to change that. Uh, so yeah, Miss Sasuke is headed towards a Morlias and Vincent, I assume, still making out behind the marketplace? Now we're just kind of like, 
uh, like drinking coffee super close together, kind of like, you know, like that honeymoon phase where like you're super duper sweet on each other and like just like constantly like holding hands and touching and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Because we definitely fucked before we made it official, but like now we're like official, so it's like <laughs> I it's see. like new and precious and you know. I see. I see. I see. They're kind of just like talking and like whatever and like you know canoodling, general canoodling. Yeah, necking, you know. Yeah, hey, yeah. Um. But yeah, that yeah, is I'm what you like approach riots. more. Uh, that is what you approach, Miss Sasuke. Uh, Marlias. <laughs> he he kind of looks and he's Happy like, yes. Older. Um, were you aware that um? No. There's a, a lot of people out looking for you and me specifically, trying to arrest us for a for a murder in the Eastern Kingdom. Wait, what? Crazy. <laughs> Weird. When they need a roll deception check. <laughs> yes. You also just okay. see Vincent <laughs> just go and like <laughs> <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> I'll roll an insight check. Yes. Fair yes. Too. Motherfucker. Oh wait, Boblin. Fucking. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> you believe them? Okay. <laughs> yes. Um. Absolutely. So, I I think I'm allowed to go, but um, I was told that we need to be really careful. My worry, though, is that people are out looking for us, and I don't have a way to disguise how I look. Like you do, so... Just, like, paint your face. It's fine. Or we can um, saw off your, your horns. If and, uh, anybody has a disguise kit that can be given to, like, that can work on... Or we can horribly disfigure you, and they'll never recognize you again. Yeah, I like that idea. That's good. Um... Yeah, I don't like that idea, <laughs> and I don't have a disguise kit. Weird. Um, Boblin, do you have a disguise kit? Uh, not one that's very handy right now. He has lockpicks. He could lockpick your face. Hmm? This is kind of threatening. <laughs> <laughs> maybe uh, maybe, maybe we can find say. some bed sheets or something and make, make it like a cape. Like a, like oh. a fancy looking cape. And they'll... I mean, I already have a cloak, so... <laughs> Uh, this, this will be that. one that we can wrap around your face, and they'll yeah. They'll just think that you're like suffering from some sort of horrible skin disease. <laughs> we could just say that we're we're uh, plague victims, and that they shouldn't uh, come any closer. Garrett, mm -hmm. would you say that there's um, like I don't know, like paint or anything for sale? <laughs> Not in this market. Again, this marketplace is still, like, just barely I know, come I just, together again. I know. I just don't ha really have any options. There, so. uh, there I look be... at Vincent and I say, Vincent, Vincent, do you have any face paints? Uh, Vincent's like, I don't have any face paints, but I do have a couple of cloaks I could lend you. Uh, okay. I don't know if That'd that's going nice. to help, though. It's this something way. better than nothing. Uh, Stop can I like do? Her, her. Can I like, you know those like uh like in nineties like girl teen movies where there's like a transformation uh montage? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Gonna I, make a montage. <laughs> but can I do that with Mrs. Sasuke <laughs> where I like I put her in a bunch of different clothes and like try on different hats and like do her makeup differently and like style her hair differently. Uh, I mean, yeah, yeah, you can you can take your time and try and do that. It without a disguise kit wouldn't necessarily hide essential features, but you can give Miss yeah. Sasuke a makeover. I don't need a makeover. I'm beautiful as I am. But thank oh, you I I have a very good idea. And I walk walk behind here and I pull up my disguise kit and I pull it like 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 oh a clown God. wig <laughs> and a clown nose. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I'll walk back over to Kisame and just say, he can put these on. <laughs> Kisame's like, I'd rather drop dead. You can be our, <laughs> you can be our enormous gesture, Kisame. Kisame doesn't need to disguise himself. I do, and I... I oh, then would you that. would you like to wear these? No. I like... Would you like to be our medium-sized <laughs> gesture? 
Qu question with that disguise kit is there face paint yes especially if it's a clown one yes if it is a disguise um, kit it's got a whole host of stuff that you can use to change your appearance Okay. Hey, Vincent, I will borrow a cloak, um, and then I'll just uh, bobble, and can I take the face paint? I have an idea. I, I, I don't... Uh, uh, I think I need that. I think I, I, I think don't. I, I don't think paint. I have any face paint. I just happen to have a clown no, wig and a do. clown nose. No, oh, you do. <laughs> super weird, but I think I actually need the face paint for something. Just, just like, oh my God. super <laughs> crazy. Super crazy that I need it. Please, but I definitely Goblin. Need it. I rolled a 21 deception. <laughs> you want to roll a contesting insight check there, Miss Sasuke? No, just give her the face paint. Just give her the face paint. <laughs> Stop pulling her. Give her the face paint. I have the face plate paint, please, Boblin. All right. <laughs> I walk back behind here and I pull out my kit. <laughs> and okay. I pull out... <laughs> I put, um, like, three different, like, off-color pastels. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to make her... Uh, These wait, are what, what I have color? left. What colors are they? Um, Is there a yellow green in there? Magenta, seafoam green, and... <laughs> Is there a um, yellow? Uh, no, there's there's no, no yellow. I need yellow. There is a slightly too yellow? bright orange. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you, you know need what? yellow? I'll work with orange. I think that'll work. And then I'll be like, Kisame, I'm going to need your help. And then I'm going to run back to my place and have him help me. Okay. So is, is that a no to the clown wig and the clown nose? Kisame <laughs> shouts back, yes! <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I, I just audibly laugh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, I'm Vince... going to whisper to you what I'm doing. Okay, okay. Yeah, because Vincent's bringing you just a simple, simple green cloak. Well, Elias, was that was that was that too much? Should I should I be should I tone it down a little bit? <laughs> no, it's perfect. It's perfect. What you're doing, it's great. Love it. It's just the right amount of bullying. That's rude. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I whispered to you, Garrett. Okay. Oh my god, of course. Okay. Yeah, you do okay. so, and uh, it uh, takes maybe 45 minutes to get a full, full paint job going, and you are looking very Triton-like. <laughs> um... I would say around this time, too, uh, Mortalias and Boblin, you might notice uh, Isaac kind of waiting at the front gates here and entering in. You see. Uh, Garrett, I'm going to whisper something to you, Garrett. Oh, okay. But continue what you're saying. I will. I will. This will be for when we're getting ready to leave. Oh, okay. But yeah, you see. Continue four, what you're saying. For uh, Western clerics pile out of a small wagon, meet with Isaac, and Isaac begins kind of just showing them around old good old Nellwood. Definitely hide behind Kisame because I forgot but then remembered me and Isaac's conversation that's last. <laughs> uh, that's when we leave. The thing I just said to you, Garrett, is when we leave. Is when you like, leave. Like, just before getting ready to take off. Okay. So, not, so not yet. Oh, okay. I just want to be, like, above, above board with him, you know? Got you. Gotcha. Uh, okay. okay. So Vincent, uh, not Vincent, <laughs> Morlias is going to disguise himself as his human form again, just so he's not like, he doesn't scare these people. <laughs> um, and then he's going to go up to Vincent and he's going to say, uh, care to introduce me to the new, uh, the new incoming clerics? Uh, yeah, and Isaac's just like, oh, yes. And, uh, he just kind of introduces you to each of these guys. They're just, uh, old friends of his uh that he kind of came back from the northern cleric college essentially uh and uh kind of got along with really well he explained the situation in nelwood explained that they're trying to get it on like the official kingdom registry um and 
explained that there was a lot of people there who needed some help, I explained the nature of the um, people kind of sort of disabled in the medical center. Um, and uh, yeah, yeah uh, Isaac just kind of introduces you to each of them. I kind of lean into Isaac and I, I kind of whisper at him and I say, Isaac, did you tell them who I am and who I'm associated with? Uh, he's like, um, admittedly, I told them that you were a um, benefactor from the Western Kingdom who mm -hmm. technically owns a large stake in Nailwood um, mm -hmm. and that you might be popping in and around doing business, technically. So not, I just... I gesture to my human form and I say, so they're fine with expecting this. They're not going to think that I'm lying to them. No, no. Okay, cool. Awesome. Sounds good. Yep, yep. Okay. I trust you. I, tr I entrust this. If you trust them, I trust them. It's like, I, I do. I trust them with my life. Okay. We'll see if I trust them with my life, but I do trust them with the lives of my people, which is worth more. Uh, Isaac's like, I'll be ready to go in less than half an hour. I'm just going to kind of finish up orientation with them. So, um, just again, uh, I don't know the nature of the, um, ruins mm -hmm. as it is right now. So be prepared. Pack what you- Do you want to bring need. one more of them? Do you want to bring one of the clerics with us so that we have two potential healers? Isaac's like- case. Admittedly, I don't know if they're going to be willing to go on a trip with us on such short notice. They did just arrive here themselves. That's fair. Never mind. I think that you'll be fine. I, I trust you 100%. Isaac, I think that you are more than capable well, of keeping you. us safe. Um, I will be bringing several individuals with us as well so that uh, we'll be able to have a little bit of an entourage to keep us safe. Oh, good. Good. That sounds excellent. Okay. Uh, okay. Yeah, he kind of continues on to do that. So is there any last minute preparations you guys want to make before embarking? Um, I tell the whole group, um, cause do they see, have they seen me yet? Um, I, I, I bet you Boblin has probably seen you and Morlias as you're, you're breaking up this conversation with Isaac there, you're probably turning around and you see a very blue Mrs. Sasuke. Um, our cover story is that me and Kisame are a married Triton couple. Um, and, and Kisame, so, like, turns yeah. to you, he's like, wait, that's the cover story? Yes. <clears throat> oh. You should, you should make her, like, your sister or something like that. No. He's like, I like yeah. you. <laughs> you're, my, you're my sister. You're my sister. <laughs> you're like, your sister, your sister wife. <laughs> Sist sister I look, I look him in the I eyes. I shudder when I Kisame. say that. And like... <laughs> Kisame, we are married. Deal with it. Uh, roll an intimidation check. Um, can I roll? Okay, yeah, I'll do. Ah! Um. Yeah, Kisame's just like... <sighs> I'm, I'm still telling people that's your sister. <laughs> <laughs> Kisame is like, eh. It's, it is what it is. If I gotta play the part of a hillbilly, it's for the Akatsuki. <laughs> do, they have, do they have hillbilly tritons? Kisame is like, you don't want to know what family I came from. It's worse than hillbillies. Oh. Uh. Is it like frogs or there's like a thousand? You know, never mind. No, I don't want to go that. that. <laughs> He's like, well, you see. <laughs> I walk away. <laughs> Kisame begins explaining the intricacies of I literally just walk rituals. away. Yeah. I, I'm not no. there anymore. <laughs> like, <laughs> they spawn eggs instead of like. <laughs> okay. Uh, um, I think that. Um... <clears throat> If me, if myself, maybe I can disguise myself and go into the Western Kingdom, but I think we probably should stock up on, like, health potions and stuff. Same. Before we go, just in case. But I look, I can make myself look like anybody, so. 
I look like a Triton with a husband, so I th I feel safe. Ooh. You want to come with me into the? Hand. Do you want do you to think... go? Oh, go ahead. This is Sasuke. Do you want to come with me into the city to buy potions? Yeah, my husband will come with. Okay. Well, I don't know if I feel safe with the two of you and one of me. I I will go too. Well, no, because they'll I... be looking for you. No, they're looking for a goblin. That's fair. Not they don't want to be racist, goblin. do they? Not at all. <laughs> um, plus, plus, they can't really track me with the little whirly things, so... Um, <coughs> do we want to go to the Northern Kingdom to buy potions, or do we want to go into, like, the West and buy potions? I think the I think... West is more benign than the North. So... Okay. Um, like, in terms of crime, they seem more cool with that than the North. Okay. I, have we been to the North? I don't think so. I don't think so in this campaign, no. The North okay. is hella racist, so I feel like it'd be... A goblin, whatever I disguise myself as, and then two tritons? Yeah, probably shouldn't go into the Northern Kingdom. Yeah. Just... I thought, okay, we'll, I don't we'll think hook they've a... the Northern Kingdom. <laughs> Probably not. We'll hook a left. We'll, we'll hook a left to the Western Kingdom, and then we'll head up to the North. Okay. Um, Yo, we should really look into getting, like, some traveling traders here or something like that. <laughs> I've tried. I don't know. They don't want to come here for some reason. Something about mind flayers. Um, <laughs> but I would also... Uh, so we can stock up our cart. I would also like to uh, bring... But Jaeger tends the bar, he can't leave. But I don't want to separate Cop Cop and Jaeger. They've also I want been them to training come with. really hard with me and Kisame, and I'm pretty sure they would like to uh, show off, show their, off their stuff. I... Yeah. I mean, the... I'm gonna go to Jaeger you... and I'm gonna say, What's up? What's up, Todd? Are you, are you sure it's it's wise to bring the, the, the frog man? He looks very squishy. And meta is because he still has 16 HP. But. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> he only has 16 hit points? Yeah. Has he not leveled up at all? No, no, I don't really level up the NPCs. Can you do that, please, so that my NPCs don't fucking die, please? Please? Uh... Garrett. I mean, I upgrade them with armor and stuff. Garrett, you should no, at least, like, they should fucking should level with us. Them, like, at least Cop Cop and Jaeger. Like, maybe not Isaac and... Vincent, because they're, they're no, not give Isaac crazy. and Vincent fucking. They're but you see, it's though. like yes, but then it's like if I level up one NPC, then I'm probably gonna be scaling leveling all NPCs. That is that is a oh, lot no, but, of work. <laughs> but Jaeger, but Jaeger and Cop Cop are special. They are special. They have definitely so... done enough to earn a level up, but I'd want to give them a proper level up and not just one that I did on the fly here in, like, two seconds. Okay, maybe we shouldn't take them then. I don't want them to die. So I'm going to go to them. I'm going to I'm going to give Jaeger a great big hug, and I'm going to give Cop Cop a gentle kiss on the forehead. Um, a gentle slimy kiss on the forehead. I'm going to say, boys, I need you to look o look after my city for me. We'll be back in a few days. They just kind of are like, of course. Jaeger, find yourself a replacement to run the bar because I need you out here pounding the pavement um, to keep this place safe. I think <laughs> we could use you more in the field than uh, in the bar at the moment. Yeah, Jaeger agrees and he will find a replacement <laughs> immediately. Excellent. I love uh, them. I I also say goodbye to Cop Cop and Jaeger, and I'm like, don't forget what we taught you. You guys can do it. We believe in you. The, the entire time I'm like... behind her, going, don't put it in, put it in, put it Yeah, Cop Cop just kind of gives you a big thumbs up and a smile. I love how um, I die for him. I turn to Kisame, and I'm like, Kisame, Boblin's bullying me. He's <laughs> <like> <laughs> It's like I can, I can try and squish him, but he does have the pointy arrow things. But I mean, like I, I oh, can give it a true. try. Oh, that's true. Wait, actually, don't, 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 don't. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I just look at them and give them like, like, like eyebrow, like, like blinks, just like back and forth, <laughs> as I walk backwards away from them. <laughs> like, uh... You just make a, you just fucking pantomime drawing a bow. <laughs> 
I have can, to pee. Oh, 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 you can guys I, can keep on talking, but I have to pee. Can I, Garrett? Oh, okay. Try try to make like a cool thing where I shoot an arrow like two feet up into the air and try to catch it. Sure. Like 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 I'm not like shooting it at myself, but like You're I'm just, just like clicking like, it and just like. And then just trying to catch it. Yeah, roll me a sleight of hand check here. Call that like a trick. 18? Yeah, you're able to do that. Alright. I do that. (laughs) (laughs) Kisame just like watches you do that and he's like, show off! What is? I just I just laugh and I said next time I uh, should probably not use the poison arrow, huh? Like, <laughs> like... <laughs> <laughs> you just see Kisame shake his head and walk away. If I would have messed that up, that would have really hurt. <laughs> <laughs> just grab. I one shot myself with sneak attack and like. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you surprised yourself. <laughs> Only Boblin can take out Boblin. <laughs> That's actually his motto now. Only Boblin can take out Noblin. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Uh, is there any other prep uh, Miss Sasuke or Boblin you guys wanted to do? No, just... Um, I, oh. I, oh, sorry. Go ahead. No, you're fine. Go ahead. Oh, I was just going to say, I just talked to Kisame about our cover story. And I'm like, this is how we met. This is where... <laughs> this is when we had our first kiss. And I just say really annoying things. Things like that, Tim. Okay. Yeah, he's like, man, you thought a lot about this. This is concerning. <laughs> I think about a lot of things, Kisame, and then I wink at him. <laughs> he's just like, oh, boy. Don't yeah. let Sasuke find out yeah, about that. Yeah, you literally just see him, like, trying to call Sasuke. He's like, Sasuke? 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 <laughs> Sasuke? Don't worry, Sasuke's he doesn't want to talk answering. to his doesn't want to talk to his wife she's still bitter <laughs> oh my god <laughs> this is why she left him in the other campaign <laughs> well this is I mean, didn't he die um, so, so, so yeah. did you leave him while he was dead uh, yeah. he's, <laughs> gonna, he's gonna come back and then i'm gonna officially dump him oh my god. because i'm already remarried and i won't i refuse to cheat on kisame and so this is when he unlocks his uh uh <laughs> Uh, what what's that version of the the, the Sharingan the oh, ma- 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 Mangeku Sharingan oh, and yeah. he lights he, and he lights Kisame on fire with the black fire <laughs> like oh, God yeah. <laughs> yeah I'm definitely gonna have to put Kisame in hiding it's already been <laughs> discussed um, not but, that not that he can get him but okay so, so when well, we get to the north though oh sorry sorry the entire time when you guys were talking I was just thinking the thing that popped in my head is Sasuke got cucked. He did. Yeah. Yeah. He, he, fucking he, legit he might he like got... it. Sasuke, uh, I mean, who knows? That's up to Garrett. <laughs> Do you think that's in his characterization? Uh, Does Sasuke I, like getting cut? I can't Is he actively or cut? deny. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to really delve those those fan fictions and find that <laughs> answer. I'm sure Emily you can dig him up for you. <laughs> We're also assuming okay. she hasn't already. Yeah, <laughs> like, that's true. She's probably uh, written them herself. <laughs> <laughs> Sasuke getting cucked by Kisame. Sorry, oh sorry, God. sorry, sorry. There actually are oh. a lot of him, Kisame, and Itachi ones. And it's quite disturbing. Mm. <laughs> Wait, the three of them getting down to the clown? Yeah. Like Isn't the... Itachi Sasuke's brother? Yep. Yeah. yeah. That's not right. That's not right. Yeah, it's not. That's no. not right. Yeah, well, so moving on. Yep, moving uh, on. Okay. <laughs> so, so, so here, here bear, that thing. Also, that thing that I said to you earlier about yes. uh, the right. thing that I say. Just I, I like I ba- yeah. I basically say, remember that conversation we had about the thing? Uh huh. This is this is that's it. That's the thing. That's the thing. Uh, so you guys are heading out wait, then? Or... Wait, 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 wait. Quick, oh, Todd, oh, what are oh. your preparations? Oh, no, they're not preparation. It's just when we get there, I want to break away and go see Lucinda. Because I, w- I okay. want to ask about the mission that I paid for last night. Oh, okay. But they can do their shopping uh, first. I'm going to I'm gonna grab another drink. Okay. I, I, I'll be listening, though. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, what, does, what does Vincent say to me saying that to him? Yeah, when, once you okay say it? that, he, he does look a little surprised, and he's like, 
the canoe? Yeah. Don't judge me. Uh, no judgment. I'm just, um... He's pretty cute, oh, isn't he? Ah, uh, yes, he does have a nice ass. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you guys talking about? <laughs> I killed her. Okay. Who are you guys? Hey, hey, who are you guys talking about? Don't worry about it. This no, is it's just couple it's just a couple things. It's just a couple things. <laughs> couple things. Kisame isn't gay. You can't take him. What am I talking about Kisame, you freak? Okay. <laughs> Vincent's like, don't worry, he too has a nice ass. He does. He does. He's, it's true. He does. He looks like he's cut like a Greek god. Kisame is literally overhearing all of this. Is like walking awkwardly, like uh, <laughs> he's like uh, he's holding his butt in his hands. Yeah. <laughs> Please don't look at it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. Let's let's go to the, let's fucking giggity get all wrecked right. at the Western Go Kingdom. into the way. Boink. I can still hear you guys. I'm just gonna be off cam. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Right. I'm good. Everything's fine. Alive? Um, Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Alive? It's fine. Don't think, think about it. It's fine. Yeah. It's fine. Yeah. It's fine. Yeah. It's fine. Um, yeah, you guys have arrived in the West. Uh, where did you want to go? Um, hang on. I'm checking the stores right now. We should go somewhere where we're gonna find health potions. That's where I'm looking. Ah, that's a good idea. I just realized that I have more Bacardi in the fridge. Oh. Who wants to get fucking riggedy wrecked? Playing the Bacardi card. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I am going to mute myself for a second so that I can uh, grind coffee. Okay. So I don't forget for the morning time. But I'll be able to hear you guys. Maybe. Over the sound of my coffee grinding. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Hey, what happened to uh, Dupu? Where's Dupu in this universe? Uh, Dupu is technically a traveling god. So he's a. Uh, what? He's in Dupu the universe. became a god? Yeah. Technically, Dupu what? was always a god. Technically. What? Dupu was always a god? Yeah. What? That's crazy. Oh my god. <laughs> hey, uh, Garrett, really quickly, give me a give me a Dupu phrase. A Dupu. That's, <laughs> that's, 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 that's all I got for you today. <laughs> uh, so, um, <laughs> Dupu Forge just taxes. Wait, so, uh... Um... <laughs> Bad news, there's no potions. What the fuck? Where are there no potions in the city? Garrett, fix it. Now. They, they, ha they have I... a healing they have a healing salve. Yeah, there's healing That's salves, it. which are technically more reliable. Okay, I'm mad about that, but also I'm muting myself so that I can grind coffee. Okay. Um I'm gonna Wait, how much are the healing cells? Oh, there's also healers kits too. First aid kit. Okay, Garrett. Yes. Um, I'm gonna buy some first aid kits, healing salve. Okay. And, um, how much? How much are you getting of each? Uh, let me grab my phone so I can do that. Um, I'm going to get two first aid kits. How much for each? How much are the selves and how much uh, is the, the kit? The, fir the first aid kits, you get three uses and they're 80 gold pieces a piece. How much is their potential heal? Um, it doesn't necessarily help you heal. It just increases your ability to use medicine checks. 
So like if you're um, stabilizing a dying that's creature. Not bad. Yeah. Um and how much are the selves? Two hundred gold pieces. Oh, what the fuck? But they restore just a flat ten hit points. Uh, that's not bad. Okay, two hundred. Um, I'll buy four. Buy four of them. All yeah, right. Selves. That'll be yeah. eight hundred gold pieces. Oh, I just subtracted it. Fucking. I'm gonna get. Um, yeah, Lucinda pieces. does sell potions of healing for hundred gold pieces. Does she buy some? Probably. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. I forgot I added in Lucinda's services. Probably, quick. Come, Poblin. Poblin, please. We need you. <laughs> I mean, how, how, how many? <laughs> like... <laughs> as many as you can, please, I beg of you. Um, I'm going to buy 18,000 gold worth of healing potion. <laughs> oh, <laughs> man. I'm, I'm kidding. <laughs> Woof. <laughs> We're gonna get fucking crunk on healing potions. <laughs> Turn down for what? <laughs> just, just pouring them on yourself. Here, I'm gonna buy three healing salves. Okay. And I'm giving one of them to Kisame. Okay. And then I'm also gonna buy four healers kits. Okie dokie. What do the healers kits do? Uh, the healers... They help you do medicine checks. Healers kit. That's what you just said to me, Garrett, is they help you do medicine checks. Yeah, there's a first aid, aid kit which helps you do uh um, Yeah, I know the first medicine aid kit. checks. I'm... Yeah. Uh, healers kit lets you expend one of the uses to just uh, automatically stabilize a dying creature. So you don't have to do mm. any checks as long as you have a healer's kit. You can just spend an action and a use of the healer's kit to stabilize a dying creature. Those are nice. Wait, do they have to be dying? I mean, it, it, it would be, it would stabilize a creature at zero hit points. So if they, yeah, they would they have to happen. be dying. Basically, it doesn't, okay, then I'm doesn't only restore gonna get... anything. Then I'm only going to get two of those. Okay. Um... Okay, yeah, that's all I'm buying, so that's 860 gold for me. Okay. Perfecto. I'm good after that. Okay. Boblin, you getting anything? Um, the, the, well, the healing we'll potions healing are how much? 2d4 plus 2? Yeah. So a total potential uh -huh. of, of 10. Can I buy 5? Five, five healing potions? Yeah. Yeah. I'll be five. Okay, it's all to gold. 500 gold. No problem. Add five. I'll bring it to the table. Do, do, do. Um. Okay. But yeah, that I did want to um, talk to Lucinda about that job from the night before. Oh, okay. Pam. So we are going to go ahead and wait really quick. Can I talk to Boblin and be like, "Hey, Boblin"? Sure. Boblin. Hey, uh, what's what what's up? Um, question. Since we're in the Western Kingdom, do you want to try to just keep a lookout and see if that dude is around, like like we talked about before? Which which dude? The dude that's asking for Sasuke. Um. I mean, I guess I can. I mean, that that, that that still offer up. I think that offer still on the table for like twenty thousand gold. Yeah, if you want, uh, me and Kisame, while you're going to talk to Lucinda, we can try to do like a walk around and see if we can spot anything unusual. And you guys but have I no idea who this is. I mean, I 
there's i mean there's some people in sasuke's past i could think that would be asking for him but the description that you've given me isn't anything to know for sure so but if i spot one of those people i'll know it's them oh my god fair fair enough Okay, mm. so me and Peace uh, are going to do that while you go talk to Lucinda. I just realized, Bobla, and I, w I should also mention, because you, you paid Lucinda on uh, near the end of the fifth day um, for that thing, and the uh, the meeting that was shown by the note uh, that you retrieved said that it was going to be happening in two days, so it would and the, the event would be happening today. Oh, so. I thought we'd fast forward to where it was that night. Uh, no, no. So it was, because you guys got through six and a half days in oh, okay. total, and that was at the okay. end of the fifth day. So it, it would literally be happening today. Okay, then then, then I wouldn't. I thought yeah. that it happened last night. No, day. you're okay. I definitely did too. I was like, wait a second, I had to double check, so. Okay. Then yeah, I, I wouldn't then. Uh, and then Miss Sasuke, we're doing a perception check. Oh, where'd she go? Um, I do want to buy that. Uh, uh, where did it go? There was that necklace or something for seven hundred and fifty that gives you plus one to perception checks. <coughs> Let me see if I. Can... Amulet of the Wary. Which store is that in? Uh, Maven's Menagerie. Maven's Menagerie. Yeah, did you want to buy that? Yeah, if I can. Yeah, absolutely. That is 750 gold pieces. No problem. Also, but... Garrett, once you're ready, I rolled a perception check mm -hmm. to look for anyone in the kingdom oh, out and about that I might recognize. Okay. I go into perception. Attributes. Perception roll. Uh, okay. So you are taking a <coughs> oh, oh. Excuse me. Uh, you are taking a look around for that for that guy yeah okay so as you're kind of hunting around the carpenters district you take a couple of things in uh stride here as you're noticing them um first off yeah there's definitely a couple of pirouettes that you've seen just fly by in the area just kind of, uh, mainly kind of circling here uh, in the Carpenters District. Um, you also definitely see there's the normal guard force around here, um, but then there's guards in other kind of like slightly different colorations here. Uh, they're just just different enough for you to be like, hmm. Like, I don't know if those are the, the typical Western guards on, on force and on duty here. Um, as far as the dude is concerned, though, no real sign of him. Like, Carpenter's Bistri District is real bustly and busy today. Um, you don't I said I did, like, a walk around the whole town. The whole town. The yeah, no, that's fair. And I rolled a natty. Yeah. Ooh, you got a natty on perception. Which, which, if you look at that, I, I went into the uh, attributes and abilities tab and went in and added it or made it a plus three modifier, even though my my uh, sheet says plus two, so it says even perception two at the bottom. But if you look at it, it says d twenty or uh, plus three. And that, yeah, that's probably your so, additional modifier. So you went into the actual yeah, sheet itself. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. Perfect. Um. Hmm. I do think that thing requires attunement, though. But, uh... I, it's a natty either way. Yeah, it's a natty either way. 
Um, but yeah, technically that plus one won't be until you fully attuned to the item, which I want to say. Let me just check real quick how long attunement takes. If we're at a cart or something like that, I can attune to it. Because I think it's like an hour studying with the item. It's like an hour or two, like meditating with it or something like that. You have to spend, yeah, an hour, so a short rest worth of time. Yeah, so if we're taking a caravan to the north, then that'll be fine. Yeah, exactly. Um, so, uh, yeah, I would say, Boblin, with your uh, natty, you notice two things. First of all, you do notice a couple of those guards in the kind of different colorations than the normal Western Guard forces. Two of them seem to be being led by another dude that you see definitely has a pirouette control gauntlet on him. Uh, and he just kind of seems to be walking around chatting up a couple of different people uh, right now kind of in the lover's district. Um, then, as you are taking a look around, uh, you notice out just right outside of the Golden Glow Grill... Uh, there does seem to be, uh, somebody chatting with, uh, another person. They're just kind of, like, in this cloak, and they're kind of hunched over, and they're just kind of talking a little bit to this, uh, dude. And, uh, as you're passing by this conversation pretty casually, uh, the dude that he was talking with just is like, Sorry, man, I, I don't know anybody named Sasuke, and just walks away. Wait, can, wait, can I... that's in the Carpenter's District, though. Why didn't I see that? Because uh, it, it's nice. So even with a 90, like, he got a natty. But, um, it, yeah, it, it's he, he's trying his best to be hidden. Whatever. <laughs> and and what, was, what was the information that I needed, Garrett? Was just the name of the person that was looking for Sasuke? Or do I need to find this person and, like, capture They wanted him, you or... to take him out. They wanted you to straight up kill him. It's a bounty on his head. I thought it was information. Or they take it. They, want, was, like, they wanted to know who was going after him, but at the same time, like their their Ooh. priority was to t like make sure that guy wasn't running around doing that anymore and stop him by my, any means necessary essentially my stealth to to follow him around is not very high yeah so we're gonna do just a quick check here do, 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 do. don't look at the stream right now you don't know nothing <laughs> ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba -ba. i ain't gonna metagame nothing Oh my god, don't kill me. You're man. lucky. Uh, so you can tell that this figure is kind of mo like moving, one, a little fast for what looks to be like somebody is a hunched over old man. Um, but for the most part, they're not noticing you, but they do seem to be on edge a little bit as they're moving around. Okay, I'm going to, I guess, continue to follow this person. Oh, okay. Um, you see them, uh, eventually enter into the Lover's District. Uh, again, they enter into, um, what looks to be the pawn shop here. Uh, they ask around a little bit, get nothing. And are they just going around just asking specifically, do you know Sasuke, do you know Sasuke, you know, or is, is it different questions? There, there's it... some different questions. Some of them are, he, he starts off by asking if they've uh, seen any, uh, just like, people walking around with either, uh, like, a large katana-like blade, and he's also asking about a tiefling as well, um, looking for a, a someone who might be hanging out with a tiefling with a, a large blade. And then, yeah, he usually name drops, have you heard the name Uchiha or Sasuke? Um, and then getting nothing, uh, he exits again the pawn shop. As he goes around to the Carpenter's District, you definitely notice him clock the dude with the pirouette control gauntlet. They seem to lock eyes for a second. 
and then the figure in the hood just kind of continues to move on. Now the guy with the pirouette gauntlet is starting to approach the hooded figure. Um, and then... Can we roll another stealth? or? Yeah, go ahead and roll me another stealth here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oof, a natty, wow. a 31. Fuck. <laughs> uh, okay, so yeah, you are perfectly safe. Um, you kind of just duck down uh, a crowd of people, which is kind of hiding in basically amongst their, their legs. Um, as uh, this guy with the pirouette gauntlet uh, is starting to kind of interrogate the hooded figure, um, asking him uh, if he's seen, uh, and he gives the full descriptions of both Morlias, Miss Sasuke, um, and the entire, the, the entourage there. Uh, and the hooded figure just kind of shakes like, nope, nope, haven't seen him. Nope, I haven't seen him. Uh, and the marshal... Can I tell, does, does his voice sound any different? Like he's trying to hide who he is? Roll, it, roll me an insight check here. Nine. Nine. You've never heard this person's actual voice, so it doesn't particularly sound strained in any way so they're either using their normal voice or they're very good at voice acting okay um and uh this this guy is just continuing to interrogate him for a while um the hooded man eventually just kind of like walks away he's like sorry i can't help you today uh, son uh, i'll have to catch you later and just kind of walks away uh, and you definitely notice it looks like the uh, guy with the gauntlet has now programmed a pirouette to follow the hooded figure. Okay. And do I do I remember, was the directive to kill him from, like, Lucinda, or was it from the Akatsuki? Lu Lucinda gave it to you, but she told you specifically this was an Akatsuki contract, and she seemed kind of loath to give it to you. Okay. If it's an Akatsuki contract, I seem less... Well, I guess, I mean, I, this is this is a character choice. Yeah. Would Boblin care who it is, given it's a 20,000 gold reward? That's fair. I guess it depends on how much 20,000 gold is worth to Boblin. I feel like Boblin would want it, want the intel before he made a decision like that. Yeah, that, that's, you know? that's kind of what he's... Yes, he's he's just gonna keep following. Like, how long is all this taking, by the way? Uh, this has kind of gone on in the course of about maybe forty minutes or so. Okay. Enough time for the others to do their shopping, at least. Okay. Um, I'm kind of locked in on this thing now that 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 that's presented itself. So I'm gonna keep following the guy. Okay. Uh, Morlias and Miss Sasuke. Uh, are you guys looking to meet back up with each other? I'm going back to the cart to make out with Vincent. Okay. Um, I'm still gonna just walk around the neighborhood with my fake husband. Okay. Um, because I haven't found, I haven't seen anybody and or Boblin, so. Right. And Boblin. You ain't gonna with a 31. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Boblin, I would say that you definitely do see uh, Miss Sasuke and uh, Kisame walking around. Do you make any attempts to kind of get their attention? I don't think Boblin would because he's he still very much doesn't trust them. That's um, fair. And doing so might cause him to lose track of the person he's tracking. Okay. So I don't uh, think I do. Boblin would, would break away from tracking this person to go. I I know it's a long shot, but can I do a perception check to try to like at least spot Boblin? Yeah, yeah, you could sure you can sure try. <laughs> I might natty. You, you know, never know. Um, probably not, but maybe. I close, oh. but no cigar. Uh, so what are you up to, Miss Sasuke and, Ki and Ki? Are you guys just kind of walking around? Yeah, I'm trying to find either or someone that I would recognize or Boblin. So because we're not leaving without Boblin anyways. Right. So and my thing is, if 
they're waiting on me. Like I would assume Relias would just call my ring. So um, true, true. Or keys to move. So um, Relias doesn't have his ring. Relias got rid of his ring. Um, yeah, but Miss Sasuke, I don't think knows that. Yeah. Oh. Um. Yeah. Also, wait. So since he's looking for me, this dude. Wouldn't he also run, like, a perception check to see if he sees me? Yes, but you are also currently in disguise and also running around with Kisame. So he might recognize Kisame before he recognizes you. Um, uh, let me go ahead and roll that perception check. Wow. Ugh. Same diff. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay, well, that's just what I'm doing, so... Okay. Uh, so, Boblin, you're just kind of tailing him for a little while? Yeah, until I can get either, like, a chance that I could take him out, or until I, I get some some information that would stop me from doing so. Okay. Okay. If, if Boblin has a chance to make 20,000 gold, he's, he's, he, he's going to. Right. Unless it, unless there's a good reason that would stop him from doing it. That's fair. Um, so yeah, you see uh, the hooded figure kind of making his way around. He, he seems to be mainly checking out this frontal area of both the Carpenter's District and the Lover's District. So he kind of bounces around, thomps, loans, and savings, the Ironworks Guild, Genius Fletcher. He's doing roughly the same song and dance that he has been doing um this is this is about two hours in he doesn't seem to be taking any time for rest or anything like that so he's, he's not gone down any dark alleyways nothing like that uh he's definitely <laughs> snuck down uh do 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 uh, <laughs> right, check, I, check I, your I see your, I see your chat i see your chat oh. Uh, Got gotcha. you. I got okay. nothing else to do, so I'm just gonna do. No, it. that's fair. Uh, yeah, because this is this is taking about two hours. So is that just kind of what yeah, you want to spend your time doing in the cart? This is taking two hours. Yeah, I, I, has I also. Yeah. Fucking guys, come on! <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, I'm doing that for two hours. That's fine. <laughs> okay. I also did not think it would take two hours to get him to walk down a dark hallway. But, <laughs> uh, yeah. That's fair. Um, yeah, eventually you see him make his way into the Bright District, um, and he seems to be checking out a few different things, um, it's starting to hit around, like, 4 p.m., and you see him, uh, literally just kind of, like, walk next to the abandoned, this kind of old abandoned church area, kind of take a look around and then once seeing like okay this is no nobody's around uh and the area itself here is kind of uh kind of run down you see this hunched over hooded man suddenly jump through a window and he just like at like prick like agile yeah yeah like E easy as <laughs> easy as pie just jump right through this kind of like already somewhat shattered window okay um <laughs> more like yes yes all of this is happening in the background can can i sneak into the church like yeah like, roll like... me a stealth check that was a 15 15 so you are entering into the abandoned... Oh, man, this has got some old NPCs. Let me clean this up real quick. Was that cop cop in there? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's just grab me a hooded dude. Okay. I don't really have a hooded figure, so this is going to be our old man here. 
Okay. Just gonna have to suspend some disbelief here. Um. And yeah, you sneak on in, uh, and this figure uh, has actually dropped the cloak a little bit. Uh, and you see them over at this sort of bedside, kind of rifling through a knapsack, and suddenly they begin discarding this cloak. Uh, and they're actually stripping down a little bit, um, and they're starting to put on an entirely different uh, set of clothing. Uh, in in the middle of them changing, uh huh, where like like when they're not like wearing the least armor, like when he's like taking things off, uh huh. I'm I'm gonna shoot. All right. <laughs> So, yeah, this would be a sneak attack. Go ahead and yeah. fire. Um, with advantage, that's a natty. <sighs> which, it, which, it, which it crits anyways when I, when I automatically hit him. Yeah. So does that stack when I crit with a crit? No, no, you don't get okay, a, so a just... double crit, but... Holy okay. crap. So it's still, it's still that doubled. Or do you want me to roll again? Uh, give me just a second. So I need to set up this guy's mm -hmm. stuff here. See if he just drops dead right well, here. I, I still haven't even rolled sneak attack. I know. I know. Um, okay. So yeah, it, it rolled it twice here. So we've got all your types of damage here. Okay. So do I need to roll sneak attack twice. Yes. Um... Oops. So another 28 damage on top of that. Okay, so we're going to do that. That. Uh, I'm also going to use Fury of the Small to do another uh, 7 damage. Ooh. And Fury of the Small. <laughs> yeah. Uh, just on that damage alone, you see this figure literally just... <laughs> arrow right through the back falls over onto the bedside he, there's blood pouring through this uh bed he looks dead as a doornail just just to make sure he's dead i'm gonna shoot again <laughs> you're gonna shoot again yeah I'm, well good boblin if, if it's it's if it's for a hit he's gonna make sure the job is done that's fair that's fair um, so. yeah, yeah, with, a uh, literally prone dead body, you, you hit. Okay. Yeah, and right, that, I can, I can assume that this person is dead then. Yeah, you see this second arrow fly through his side, uh, and, and he literally no... just kind of slides over a little bit, kind of hand on the bed, and then just coughs up this big... Just glob of, of blood and then just poof, face plants on the floor. Okay. Uh, Bobble, not knowing any different or any better, <laughs> is just going to walk in and, and loot the body. You know, it's like. Okay. Uh... <laughs> Roll me an investigation check. <laughs> that was I'm, what's I'm, hey, I'm... wait. That was what's his face, right? <laughs> Who's, wait, who, uh, what's, what's his, his face? Kaka Kakashi? That was Kakashi, right? <laughs> it no was an investigation check. Garrett, I'm, I'm gonna. I'm I, just gonna say twenty. Like, uh, I am telling can, Cheyenne what you just can, did. Talk. Can, can I take? Can I take twenty, Garrett? Uh, just... I did. I did look it up. So technically, taking twenty isn't a thing in fifth edition. Oh, okay. There's taking okay. ten, so it's it's your passive score. So it would be ten plus whatever your your current modifier to investigation would be. Okay. Okay. So you can do um, that, or you can roll for it. Uh, that's a four. Then. That's a four. Then I I will say just because you do have the time, like I'll, I'll and I, I'd have to double check on this part, but I I think the way I'm gonna work out passives is that you can roll for it, and then if it's higher, you can take that, or at least you get the flat passive because you have okay, the time. Okay, so then it would be then it would be eleven. Eleven. Okay. Uh, so yeah, all you find on this guy is 80 gold pieces, thieves tools, 30 foot cable cord, 30 feet of rope, 10 kunai, 
and four paper bombs. Okay. I mean, I was all gonna that. try to like romance this guy at some point too. <laughs> <laughs> um. So, wh what uh, what proof could I could I bring that this is the person that they were looking for? Cut off his head and stick That's it in your. That's a nose very nose. good question. I mean, if if there Cut is nothing head. else, then I then Cut I would. That's Cut totally something head. an assassin would do. Like, what are you taking? What did you say? If 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 the only oh way God. to prove his identity. No. It would be to take his head, then that's what Bobbin would do. Like, <laughs> I've done it before. Like, it's... <laughs> yeah, yeah. You want you want to take this fucker's head? Yeah, Bobbin doesn't know who this is. He yeah, shit. Yeah. Like, all okay. he knows is he's got twenty thousand gold. Yeah. Like... <laughs> uh, you take the man's head. You cut that completely off. It's gonna take you about forty minutes. I um, told Cheyenne what you did, so oh she knows God. what you did. That I shot Kakashi? <laughs> yeah. yeah. And I texted her that you just beheaded him, so... <laughs> oh, dear. I think, that, I think that decapitating him and then putting his decapitated head in your bag of holding is probably worse than just cutting someone's head off. Probably. Yeah, probably. Probably. Um, also, there, there's, there's no headband head... or anything, Garrett. Not that, not, not, not that Bobble would know to look mm. for that, but I uh, mean, yeah, actually, there is a headband you would find on his uh person as well. Again, you've never really seen this kind of headband because no, Sasuke I... hasn't been wearing, wearing that shit around. Um, yeah. but it does look remarkably similar to like the one on Kisame's head, who which has a slash through it, just a different symbol on it. Yeah, this one is the symbol of a leaf. Okay. He, he, he also he would take that if he wasn't already wearing it you know yeah no the, the guy had he wasn't wearing it in his current disguise it was kind of amongst his possessions okay well then i do that and then i would uh probably well i think Bob would, would want to get them well fuck would he, would he find them first and be like guys I, I found the guy and i or would he just go get the money just pull his head out and be like, guys, look. I feel like Bobbin would want the money. Yeah, just do it. So okay. he would he would go to Lucinda. Okay, so you're going to head to Lucinda? Yeah. As you're... So go ahead and place yourself here real quick. In, Can I in do a perception here? check to try yeah. to spot him? A... Uh, you Can roll me a perception check. Roll me a perception check. We'll go ahead and have... Kisame, roll perception oh, check as well. Oh, I got a 10. Oh, that's my Oh, I got a 23. Wait, where am I at? Uh, and then, there we go. Um, so, yeah, with that 23 of Kisame, uh, as you guys are kind of walking around, I, I assume... Was there any anything in particular you guys were doing walking around, or were you just like checking out the dishes? I told you we, we were looking for either a suspicious dude or Boblin. Oh, okay, oh, okay. Uh, sorry. Um, and uh, <laughs> um, and uh, <laughs> so uh, with with the twenty three. Uh, Kisame definitely pegs what looks to be a large slew of guards kind of heading into the Bright District. Uh, and Boblin, just as you finish cutting off this guy's head, <laughs> um, you start to hear someone creaking open the door to this place. The door ah! right over here. And where's, where's the front door at? Front door is On right here. Okay. Um uh, shit. Can I do and, and where's the window that that, where's the window at that this person came in from? Uh the window it whoops. That's oh my god. Is there is there any windows inside this this room? Uh yes, yeah. There's actually quite a few you, not in this room right here. This room is a little bit cordoned off, but literally along this wall back over here, 
there's just a slew of these windows, one of which he entered in through. And then there's a couple of windows back here, too. Okay. Uh, was, wait, um... Well, as soon as I, I hear that, then, uh, can I use my nimble escape? I mean, I guess I guess we're not in turn order. So I yeah, don't you're not in turn order right like now. That. Yeah. Um, Man, you're starting to hear can... uh, multiple feet walking inside. Oh, like, like actively walking in? Yeah, they are opening up the doors here. Uh, and then they are trying... Well, they, uh, they you hear a kind of a... <laughs> as the uh, chain kind of keeps them at the, okay. the well, very as, door. As soon as, as soon as I start hearing people, like, enter, Boblin's running out. I thought I had to, like, like do a nimble escape or something like that. Mm, so. No, they haven't... But we're not in turn entered, order, entered, so... Yeah. yeah, as soon as that happens, and I'm, I'm going to roll for stealth, and I'm going to be, be dashing yeah. out of here, at, you know... Okay. It's a twenty-three. I'm, I'm assuming it's dark inside this, uh, this church. Yeah, it's so. pretty. It's pretty hard to see here. And then you've got two of these looking, but neither of them catch it. So you jump right on out, and yeah, you escape that church. Uh, and I'm I'm out of there. I'm I'm not looking back. Yeah, that's fair. No. <laughs> uh, and yeah, you leave just a bunch of these guards. Uh, kind of as they're uh, walking Ooh, around you see that they can have... i oh it, it's after the fact so probably not but mm. it's one of those things i didn't think about till afterwards so if you want to say no that's fine mm. but but can i leave a lit dynamite behind <laughs> i'm gonna say no on that one <laughs> uh, okay and yeah you you may what? you make it out just fine okay question then I would... um uh, since he got a 23 on stealth and Kisame got a 23 in perception, can he spot him running out since that already, like, dragged our yeah. attention to that direction? Yeah, yeah, I would say Kisame kind of, like, he's like, eh, babbling. Uh, and you guys just get a catch of okay. him then, yeeting out yeah. of a, a window in the abandoned church. Maybe like, Boblin, did you find him? Yeah, I killed him, and I keep running. Like... <laughs> <laughs> I run after him. I'm like, killed who? Who did you kill? I don't know. Some guy. Some guy with silver hair. Like, and I, and I keep, I just keep running. What? Um, Mrs. Sasuke just stops dead in her tracks and just starts crying. He's amazed, like, come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. He's like no, picking no. you up uh, and taking you with him. Uh, and yeah. Uh, <laughs> I feel like you guys are running for your lives, uh, and you get to the cart. Um, and... No, I'm going to Lucinda. Oh, you're going to Lucinda? Okay. Yeah, I want to get paid. Uh, that's fair. Kisame, <laughs> like, uh, Morlias, are you, or not uh, Kisame, Miss Sasuke, are you headed to the cart, or are you following Boblin? Um, I yell at Kisame that we're running after Boblin. We're running after Boblin? Okay. So you're, you, mm -hmm. Boblin, you are headed to Lucinda's mansion. You have got a Kisame and Miss Sasuke uh, in hot pursuit, and you make it inside. All right. Got a Kisame there. And I am up here. Hey Garrett, really quickly, have I made any process on that thing that I was doing, or made any progress? Uh, roll me a persuasion check. Okay. And Vincent also do that? Sure. Uh, where is he now? Oh, he's here now. Ugh. Can I, uh, <laughs> this is, hey, wait, 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 this is really important to me. Can I, uh, take the, uh, thingy that I can do? Oops, I just opened the music app. Oh, the, the, the... thingy where I, yeah, I can roll a d10. I think yeah, it's a d10. yeah, just mark that you've used it for today. That's fine. I don't think that we're going to be doing the thing tonight, so I'm fine with that. Uh, so yeah, so you can go ahead and roll me again here. 
I don't get to roll again, I get to add. Oh, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so it's actually 16. 16! Um, <clears throat> you're, you're, you're successfully making Isaac a little nervous and confused. Okay, awesome. That's all I ask. But, I mean, you guys are that having is... great conversations. Cool. Yeah. Is it, I'm is just that sitting a maybe a little bit... Thing? I'm just sitting maybe a little bit too close to him. That's fine. Yeah, yeah. And then Vincent's maybe then Vincent's maybe sitting a little bit too close to him on the opposite side. <laughs> oh wait, so Isaac's oh. in the cart too? I didn't realize. People <laughs> yeah, yeah, Isaac Isaac's with coming him. with. Mm. Well, have fun. I just didn't realize he was with us. <laughs> uh, and okay, so yeah, Miss Asuka, you can go ahead and place yourself here on the map as well. I definitely walk in and I, I just yell, Boblin the Goblin. Yep, that's that's my name. <laughs> so did, he have a, did he have a scar on his face? I don't know. Does he have a scar on his face? <laughs> just... Wait, does, <laughs> are you pulling out his head? Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> fucked up, bro. <laughs> I'm like, Lucinda, I got proof that he's dead. I want my money. I'm like, like Bob, 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 I need to talk to you right now in private. <laughs> no, I want to get, give me a minute. I want to get my money no. and then we can talk. Uh, you definitely not, see not, okay. Conan moving towards this situation, seeing you pull out a head from your knapsack. <laughs> I'm inside this room with, with the, just, what? Oh, oh with just shit. Lucinda. There's two, there's two Boblins here. Oh, yeah, no, I'm Looks... inside the room with Lucinda. Oh, okay, so you, you went all the way there already? Yeah, oh, yeah, okay. I, I, I was going straight to Lucinda, like I said. <laughs> oh, okay, sorry, sorry. Um... Uh, so what, what we can do is we could say that this, this little conversation you two had probably happened right outside Lucinda's door, so okay. not within the Conan's. Only, the only... The only thing I want to add before you start talking to Lucinda, maybe like Boblin, can you can you not can you can I keep can I keep the head, please? Please let me keep the head. You can show it to her. But let me keep the head. <laughs> what the fuck? Um. Oh my god, no. that's a weird request. I I I please I I know him. Um. Oh, was he like your friend? <laughs> like. Yeah, yeah, he was. Oh he was. well, I'm sorry. Your um, boss paid to have him killed, so. I, I figured I know. he wouldn't be a friend. <laughs> I, can I please, can I please have his head mm. so I can at least give him a proper burial? After please. you get paid, after I get paid, you can do whatever you want fine. with it. That's fine. That's fine. Get paid. I, I just, I'm just saying, don't give her the head or leave it. I just, I need the head. Give her the head. Um, <laughs> give her the head. All right. I walk in. <laughs> uh, okay. And Lucinda's like. Hey, Boblin. Hello, Lucinda. Uh, it's it's payday. She's like, oh. Uh, that that person <laughs> that you guys wanted dead <laughs> for the twenty thousand gold. She's like, oh. Uh, and yeah, she like pulls out her booklet and she's like, oh yeah. Uh, and she's like, yeah, let me uh get that marked on for you. She's like, do you have proof? Uh, yeah, and I like show the head. And she's like, oh, God, put, the, put it away. Oh, that was Jesus. the only thing I could think of to bring Ooh. as proof. I, she's I just know. like, oh, boy. What the I'm fuck? Glad I haven't had lunch. Oh, what the fuck? Um, <laughs> oh, this is not the first time this has happened. Come on. Like, <laughs> she's like, it happened last week. <laughs> this happened three days ago. <laughs> um, and she's like, uh, all right, I will make sure you are paid. Um, she kind of calls for one of her dudes. Uh, it just takes just a few moments, and this guy literally counts out the gold for you on the table there. Uh, All right. she's like, I'll make sure the Akatsuki know, and she's like, and again, you, you know this was the guy that was walking around asking questions? Yeah, I followed him all day long. She's like, okay, I trust you, Boblin, thank you. Um, admittedly, uh, this was an Akatsuki contract, so I don't know if they're going to want to talk to you or get any clarifying questions from you or not, but you're paid, so. Yeah, uh, I mean, just if they have any questions, I mean, you can give them physical features. The guy's got a, a scar, a, a headband. He'd probably have that headband. Um, and this, uh, like, like silver gray hair. 
and she's like, "All right, all right." So I, but I give her the headband. <laughs> <laughs> and she, yeah, she kind of takes it, and she's like, "Huh." They seem to be big on those things. She's like, yeah, I I swear I've seen a few of them with this. Yeah, this will probably be good enough proof. And she just pockets it. And she's like, well, thank you, Boblin. Um, Again, come by uh, soon. And uh, yeah, that operation you paid for is going down today. The guy's already left. So I should have information for you by tomorrow on that one. Okay. um, And I have not paid the the last thousand gold yes so just take that now out of what you just gave me and she's and like, just oh, make perfect. sure make sure you put every single belonging that comes off those people in a, in a locker so i can inspect it she's I like want, i don't care what it is i want it in a box she's like you got it boblin all right thank you mm-hmm. and i walk back out and give miss sasuke the head okay i put kakashi's head in my bag of holding <laughs> <laughs> can add Kakashi's goddamn head to your inventory. Uh, oh boy! And I, I you see Bob kind of like, like just like happily strut away. <laughs> like <laughs> another job well done. <laughs> like, <laughs> oh dear! Another happy happy customer Shut who is me. <laughs> like... <laughs> um, did you see my whisper, Garrett? Oh. <laughs> okay uh you do so you actually can't get a hold of sasuke okay fine um yeah okay then i'll accept the head I, I, back I, holding I, and be like okay let's i need to go talk to isaac i walk down to this girl and i and i tell her you uh you could you could tell your boss that that contract's complete to, to check in with lucinda and she turns around and she's like, oh, the mysterious person in the West asking questions. Yeah, he's, he's dead. Uh, and she's like, excellent work, Boblin. Thank you. You've done no some good problem. service today. Uh, she's oh like, just God. a couple of questions. <laughs> was he asking about just Sasuke? He was asking about uh, Sasuke and Mrs. Sasuke. So he was asking about both of them? To, to my knowledge, yes. And did he have any other information, or was he still amidst his search when you took care of him? Uh, he was in the middle of, I think, going from recon mode to harder recon mode. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and yeah, Conan's just like, I see. Uh, well... I've never, I've never seen silver hair like that before. That was very interesting. She's, she just kind of and raises I, I an like, eyebrow. I just, I just walk out. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, and she's walking on by. Uh, Miss Sasuke, so are you, are you heading back to the cart as well? Yes, I'm actually running back to the cart because I'm like, I need Isaac right now. <laughs> okay, you're running back to the cart, Boblin. I assume you're also moving towards the cart. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so you guys get back to the uh, cart. Uh, the thick smell of tea and coffee. Um, and sex! Uh, not 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 sex. <laughs> <laughs> and um, necking. Just kind uh, of flows yeah. through. Is, that, is there a smell for that? Is there a smell for I, I want to go in there necking? and specifically... Yeah. Someone's been necking in here. <laughs> <laughs> when I get back, I... I... I specifically go inside the cart. Hmm, it smells like not sex in here. That's not what I expected. <laughs> Isaac immediately just gets stiff and is just like, <laughs> Wait, he gets stiff, um, he said? Yeah, uh, just like, <laughs> awkward. Uh, uh-huh. I'm, yeah. Isaac, I, Isaac, can I, can I talk to you in private really fast? Uh, he's like, yeah, yeah, yes, of course. Is everything okay? I start doing um, a little jig. I got paid. I got paid. <laughs> oh, Boblin, how much up, you get paid? Boblin, stop <laughs> gloating. Um, and I'm going to take him like, I don't know, like 20 feet away from the the carriage. Oh, okay. You, should, you hear faint, I got paid. I got paid. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be like, Isaac, Isaac, please, um, can you, can you resurrect somebody? 
And he's like, I, I unfortunately know. Um, I don't have that uh, quite that good a prowess. Um, but if you have a body that needs to be preserved um, until Take your messages. you bring it to a uh, true resurrectionist, um, oh. I could probably do that for you. Um, well, I, I have part of a body. Um, he's like, what is, is that enough? I, I didn't do it. I did not do this killing at all. Um, it was an, I, do you, do you show like, just, him I, or, um, I'm not going to show him the gory details. I'm just like, you don't want to see it, but I have a head. Um, but I, I really need to resurrect this person. Like now. Uh, let me check something real quick. Um, so yeah, he, he, you, you give him a, a brief description of what happened to him and Isaac's like, well, um, you are in luck as long as you have the head, um, you should, st even just a, uh, normal resurrection spell should work. So that doesn't necessarily, um, so you can do it. I can't. I can't do it. No, that that requires an intense level of spell casting that I've I've not reached yet. Um, the only other person I know of in the West who could have done it would have been Horton Dreyfus, but he is currently in the North entreating the Northern clerics. I, I I'm afraid unless you were to entreat a magic user in the Eastern Kingdom, the only other place I could think of that you could go to would either be the Southern Kingdom. Um, and entreating one of their arch priests, or going to the north and entreating an arch priest there. Okay. Okay. Um, okay. Um, when we get to the north, Isaac, can you come with me and help me get this done? And also, I don't have like any gold, so I need this done pro bono. But you know, he really didn't deserve to die. Um, and I would forever be in your debt. And our I got moms. paid. <laughs> I got bad. <laughs> uh, let me check something here real quick. Oh, that's not it. Um... Just so you know, Garrett, funds have been transacted. Funds have been transacted? Yes. So if my GP goes up significantly, that's why. Oh, okay. I need to transmorgify something here real quick. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> I guess this is as good as mine. <laughs> uh, what time is everybody getting off tonight? I'm assuming it's probably soon. Uh, did we want to call it at 9.30? Yeah, I would, I would assume so. I, I don't have I, a bedtime, so... I, I, wouldn't know, I wouldn't mind calling it at 9.30 just so I could get yeah. a little bit of time I right think... before it because I got to work tonight. Oh, gotcha. Uh, let me see if this does it here. Hmm. I swear I had a... Hmm. Um, yeah, Isaac is just like, it, it is going to be rather expensive um, to get that done. Can I pay I... them back? Can I pay them back later? This is really important. He He's like, I, I understand that, um, but I, again, um, I, I don't have what the money you, in you the also Northern Clerics. That help. Would that make it cheaper? Uh, I, I can't really assist myself. Um, and again, the North is a I lot take, more of I a take... stickler for that sort of thing. Isaac. Oop, sorry, you're breaking out, baby. And Ick, please. Um, I take Isaac by the hand and I just beg him. I'm like, please. 
Uh, so you're 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 kind of trying to persuade him to do so. Is that what? I'm sorry, yeah. you, you broke up a little bit. Go ahead and yeah. roll me a persuasion yeah. check real quick. Twenty one. Twenty one. Or actually, sorry, twenty. It's twenty three because I have that necklace. Twenty three. Uh, Isaac's like, I, I could, I could definitely try to do this, um, but again. The North, they are very stringent about what they will and won't allow. If we were to go to the South, I, I don't know the Archpriest there, but there is a chance that um, it might be either cheaper there, or at least we could get it done without as many questions being asked. Question. How long can a head last in a sack without, like, go going bad? I'd have to look up uh, decomposition rates of disembodied heads. Uh. <laughs> well, that, well, well, so hear me out. Uh, a bag of holding is like a subspace pocket, correct? Yes. There's only, ten, there's only 10 minutes of oxygen in there? Yeah, yeah. So there's a limited amount of oxygen? Well, in that case, depending on how hot or warm it is, which I'm assuming the inside of the bag of holding is not going to be affected by uh, ambient temperature, um, it's probably not going to decay for maybe like a week. Yeah, yeah, and even like then... they'll they'll be they'll be they'll be symptoms of decay. They'll they'll be uh, I mean they'll be rigor. There'll be some like uh, pooling of blood. But like if you're bringing somebody back to life, unless like the eyeballs are rotting out and the, the flesh is like, completely decomposed, I'm assuming they probably can fix that, right? Yeah, and another thing too is like the limits to resurrection is the creature has been dead for no more than a century uh so as long as okay it's... then it doesn't matter how long it's in the sack yeah, right it, it, the the face could be half melted off you could be bringing them kakashi's jawbone and they could the resurrect one, the them. only the only reason i ask is because i feel like i'm going to be sitting in the cart for a long time in the next session so you guys can like bring him back to life again and i would like to hit up that dungeon before then maybe i see i see um well, yeah, uh, Isaac will... As fun, would, as fun as it is sitting in a cart. <laughs> uh, Isaac would <laughs> inform you that, like, the the time isn't necessarily of the essence. Like, anybody who can do resurrection would be able to save him at pretty much any point in time. Uh, he's just like, the North is going to be... I'm having, I'm having this conversation with Isaac privately, though. Yes, yes. Okay. Uh, yeah, Isaac is just explaining, uh, if you were to take it to the North... One, it's probably going to be more expensive. Two, they're less likely to bargain. And three, they're going to ask a lot of questions. Not that the South also probably wouldn't ask a lot of questions, but it might be cheaper. The Archpriest might be a little bit more malleable to helping in exchange for something. Um, and it'd just be easier overall to entreat the Archpriest of the South than to get a Cleric of the North to assist you. Okay, okay, Isaac, but, um, will you come with me after we're done with this? He's, he's like, yes, yes, I can, I can arrange for, uh, that to be done. Wait, and the clerics that you brought to Nelwood, they can't do it? No, no, they are actually, um, they're, they're much on my level as far as, uh, spellcasting ability. The West is not okay. well trained. Again, Horton was the only one in our kingdom who knew that. Fine. And I just walk away sadly. <laughs> okay. Um, and with that, uh, it is about 9.30. Is there any last minute stuff you guys wanted to do? Nope. I nope. drink my tea. You drink your tea. Okay. Uh, well, then that is where we're going to call it for now. Um, I have got to go tend to my poor puppy because he is screaming his head off. Um, but I will catch you guys later. All right. Good night.